Hey what's up guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make a download button in WordPress so when anyone click on this button, they can download a file on their device. In this video, we are gonna see how to utilize the Elementor button widget to make it a downloadable button and how we can set that download file from our WordPress dashboard. And before we start, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel so when I publish another valuable videos like this, you can also get notified. Okay, here first of all to create a button, we need to install a free plugin called Elementor. So Elementor is one of the most powerful page builder for creating website with its drag and drop feature. So you can see I have already installed that on my WordPress and I also give its link on my description. You can get it from here and install that on your website. Okay, so this is the page I have built by using Elementor page builder. Right now I want to add a button underneath this paragraph right here. So I click edit with Elementor. Here first of all I need to add the button widget in this place. And here I want to modify this button a little bit. Ok, we have designed our button. If you want to know how to control and design this button widget, you can check my other tutorial which is shown at the top right corner at this moment where I discuss about how to play around with all the content and design option for this button widget. But right now I want to make this button a downloadable button. So for this go to the link option for this button and paste here the file link you want user to download. So first of all we need to upload the file. So you go to the WordPress dashboard and go to the media library and we go to our folder and we want to upload this PDF file. So after uploading the file if we click on this you can see this is the URL for this file. So we copy this URL from here, press Ctrl A and copy then we paste the link right at this place. And after that we need to go to the link option from here and in the custom attribute field we need to write down download. Ok that's it. Right now if we save our page and click on this button our file will be downloaded successfully. But here you can also additionally add a custom name for your download file. So to do this we need to add a pipe character and then name of the file. So I want to name this file free gift 2020 ok then I click update and go to preview and click on this button you can see this file is successfully downloaded in our device and this is the name which we have specified from right here ok so that's how you can create a downloadable button and make your user to download your file so right now if we go to our library you can see this is an PDF file which we have uploaded here but instead of PDF if we want to upload another type of file like this XML file, if we drag it to this place, you can see there is an error which says this type of file is not permitted for security reasons. So if you want your user to download this kind of file, you cannot do that. This is happens because WordPress only allows us to this type of files. So if you want to upload any type of file outside of this, what you need to do, we need to wrap up this file inside an archive zip file like this and then we upload this zip file in our dashboard. Right now you can see this zip file is successfully uploaded in our library. So I click on this file and copy its link and paste this link right in this place and then if I go to my preview. So right now we can see this zip file is also successfully downloaded in our device. So if we go to our download folder and unzip this file right here, you can see user can access this type of file after downloading and extracting the archive file. Alright, so that's how we can create a download button in WordPress using Elementor. And if you are not still using the Elementor page builder, I highly recommend you to give it a try because it has already 4 million active installation which is crazy. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to this channel and comment down below which type of file you want to add with your download button.
Bye for now and see you in the next video.